Diving is a demonstration of control, poise, flexibility, and precision. And the brand new state-of-the-art Sandwell Aquatic Center hosts five days of enthralling action as divers compete for six synchronized diving Commonwealth gold medals. Competition format. Men's, women's and mixed teams take part in two synchronized events. Synchronized three meter springboard and synchronized 10 meter platform. Unlike individual diving, which has preliminary qualification rounds, synchronized diving is a single phase competition, which has finals only. The divers must be synchronized to the point that you can only see one image. Beautiful synchronized, you can only see one diver from the side. If you see more than one, then they're out of sync. Divers demonstrate incredible skill in mastering the art of synchronicity, particularly in the mixed event, where divers have to allow for differences in jump power, length of run, spin and twist weight, and the way they twist. The stats. In synchronized springboard diving, two adjacent boards are used one for each diver, both standing at three metres high above the pool surface, measuring 4.8 metres long and 50 centimetres wide. For the synchronised 10 metre platform event, the platform is 10 metres high, six metres long and three metres wide, and divers can reach speeds of up to 40 miles per hour by the time they enter the water. The basics. During each phase, there are six rounds for men's teams and five for women's and mixed teams. Athletes must execute their dives simultaneously. Teams begin with two dives from a fixed degree of difficulty. The following dives are assigned a degree of difficulty based on somersaults, position, twists, approach and entry. There is no limit to the degree of difficulty of these dives. Dives are scored by a panel of 11 judges. Six score the execution of each diver and five judge the synchronization of the pair. Key moves. There are six different dive groups. Front. Back. Reverse. Inward. Twisting. And arm stand. They all break down into three simple phases. Take off. On the springboard, divers generate upward momentum or push through legs and ankles. In forward-facing dives, this includes a hurdle step to allow the diver to hit the most powerful part of the springboard to achieve the maximum height to perform the dive. On the platform, the diver can elect to perform a standing takeoff or a running start. Flight. The power and height of the jump allows the diver to perform multiple somersaults and twists in their chosen position. Pike. Oh, and they've nailed it! And top positions. The diver will be judged on their technical performance of those elements during the flight. Entry. The aim is to enter the water vertically with no splash. Achieved by a rip entry as the diver pushes through the surface of the water. You will hear the rip followed by the surface of the water bubbling. Oh, superb finish. In this daring contest of power and poise, who will hold their nerve? <laughs> 